Hey right, guys, welcome back to Woodside Farm. Um, course player seems to be negotiating. All right, with this uh, John Deere. So that's a good spot there, and hopefully, oh, he's getting on well. We'll get this done in under three hours. Now, dab on down to the JCB. And yes, the bales are gone. We managed to get them out through that gateway there. No problem. Um, time to go and unload them. A bit of a rough trip coming up this track here with the trailer. But luckily all the bales stayed on the trailer. So yeah, we've got to start. I already took one bale of grass up to the sheep and give them something to eat and we've given the cows another bale so there's only one grass bale left and the rest being hay so I'll get these unloaded and then I think We'll see how that class is getting on. As you can see, the tractor is not blocking the road. We might be. But the tractor certainly isn't. <laughs> Probably go a bit quiet here, guys. Stacking takes a little bit. Oh well, we've got one here built. That grass bill obviously doesn't want to come on. So I think the best place is to stack them in here. I actually need to move that hay wagon. Hay wagon? here on the main here. Um, feed wagon. So we finally get them out the field. After all let's carry on. It's actually all worked out pretty well. There's a cracking grass field up the rear here, right outside the farm. Um, stuff it, I'm going to leave that there. <laughs> Don't care who we block. It's not quite ready to harvest yet. But, we'll get on up here and do some silage. See, no cars. Were we really going to stop anybody travelling up and down this road? I don't think so. Anyway, forget about it. It's done now. Here we are, stuck in the bale. Oh! That didn't work very well. I tell you, this JCB is very, very sensitive. That didn't work out at all. Clever enough. 
Will it work? <laughs> this is where I just get it placed and it drops off. <laughs> oh, I don't want to move them too much. Come on. There we go. Bit of dodgy stuck in there for you guys. <laughs> it doesn't work. The first time, give it a shake. <laughs> <coughs> So, up at 51 there, where the maze is, um, the corn seems to be going alright. There's one or two sticky patches on that course that the John Deere can't really work his way out of. But on the whole, he seems to be managing. If I'm not careful here, I'm going to end up losing some hay bales onto the grass verge. Probably would have been better. Doing this one bale at a time. Although I stuck the trail at Come on, you silly thing. Stuck the trail at two at a time. Look at that, it's so quick to draw. What does that look like? Yeah, alright. And we may go and change our pickup over. I'm not a fan of that lizard pickup. It does as a job, it's a good nice run around of it. I don't know, it's just I want something different. You know. That hasn't gone well. This should be interesting unloading. Just miss that tree there. But yeah, cows have got grass, but they're going to need silage. So next episode will more than likely be a silage episode oh come on play nice that doesn't want to come off there I didn't think that would go very well come on we've got one up there Try this again, because it's not on the forks properly. It had to land like that, didn't it? Oh, da, 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 da. The joys of stacking bales on farming simulator. Can't see. Ah! And yes, the new JCB DLC is out, but because they don't have a tally handler like this, although they have got a decent tally handler. Come on, you silly thing. I think we'll just stick with this one for now. Right. 
Me and this build are going to fall out. Seriously fall out. So, in order to stop him rolling the whole blinking stack over, we're going to push him on this end and leave him upright. We had the JCB DLC did come out and I would have liked to have seen a tally hand like this. I'm not a fan of those articulated ones. Um, the bend in the middle. We'll see how this one pans out and if it doesn't go according to plan then we may well swap it over later in the series. But for now I think we'll stick with this. Oh, come on. We may be swapping over sooner than what we think. The way this is acting up now. I went on the trailer fine. <laughs> Honest. Now this is a grass bale, so we'll actually put it straight in the feeder. And then we won't get mixed up with the uh, hay bales here. It does mean we're going to have to go and get some grass, but on this map that's one thing we're not short of. We are not short on grass. It's just actually finding the time. Come on. Ah. Now we can test the reach on this JCB. up the trailer here. <coughs> Excuse me. You think we've got it there? There we go. Excellent. I almost made that look professional. <laughs> I don't know what can be said about the rest of this stack. <laughs> I'll try once more to get one up on the top here. So that's the first part of our mixed ration. Got straw down at the other field that needs to be brought up. So that will be part two of the mix rush. We just need silage, which is probably going to be. Come on, what's going on here? I know what the problem is. John Deere parked there. Alexia and put him up. So if we go on up here. Alexia should be on his way. Yeah. So. <coughs> Everything's going smoothly over here. And in the next episode we will get some silage ah pick up we said we were going to trade the pickup in didn't we where are we yeah just a quick one for the 
the end of this episode. Ah, I wouldn't get out of there. This is a decent pickup, like I say. I've got nothing against it. Nothing at all. Um, you know, giants have done us well. Given us a run around. But, I see it in so many other Let's Plays that I thought was traded in and use something slightly different. Like I said, plenty of grass fields around here, guys. We can, uh, whoa, steady. Get on with silage in the next episode. So. Let's run over here. Oh, let's just run over here. <laughs> 35,400. Decent trading price. Let's see what we can get next. Over to mods, and we have the Nissan GR, and it's a second-hand one, and it's only seven thousand nine hundred ninety-nine. Yes, we do want to buy it. Color. Let's stick with the John Deere theme. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Where we? Here we go. Nice. Think this will fit in nicely on our little farm here. Our little Nissan. There is a slight issue in this fact you can. See right underneath, which I'll show you when we get in. Camera's a bit close here as well. But you can see down there and that side, we've got two great big holes in the floor. Not the best of interiors, but they're certainly getting there. Um, and there's bound to be a V2 of it. But until then, we look rather relaxed in there. Until that comes out, we have a new runaround. So, I think we'll call it a day here. I'm going to park up in here and wait for that John Deere to come down because he's now full and he should be heading on down <laughs> and thanks again for watching I've been Sean Blaylock and this is Woodside Farm. Bye for now. <laughs>